My goodness, it is uh, 6.30 in the morning and uh, I have been up painting since 4.30 this morning. <laughs> Got me out of bed to paint angels for someone. Now, the one I did last night, that one's my angel that's staying here, my little, it's in oil. It's going to take a while to dry and stuff, and uh, I do love it. But I have two paintings today. These are the larger canvas. They're, what is it, 15 or something, 16? I'll have to measure it but they're the larger canvas sizes. And uh, so I'll show them to you in just a little while. I'm waiting for them to, you know, make sure they dry first. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna seal them or not with a, you know, I might keep them matte now, I do have a varnish somewhere under here. I do have a varnish that I use sometimes for the um, acrylics, okay, for the larger acrylics. So I'm debating on whether or not I'm going to seal them with the acrylic. But uh, the painting. I think has taken another turn. Okay, it's a, oh my goodness. <laughs> so <laughs> we'll see what you think. But um, yeah, at the at the moment I'm having my coffee, you know, and uh, waking up. But I'm feeling more confident now to do the larger paintings. You know, I was always just doing the small ones. Um, but I am starting to do the larger ones now. Now my one, I love my one angel. I put it up last night, but um, here he is, this one is in Oop, this one is staying here, but I can do prints of it if somebody likes this one and they would like a print. I can do a print. I can also have these done in a um, canvas. Okay, I can have it printed on canvas or just a regular print, a uh, photographic print. I think I'm going to ask Ronald to try it on the, um, see if he's still got the metallic paper um, to print it. You know, that's the, the business that he has that I used to do. These acrylics here are my other artwork that I was doing sealed in acrylic. It's photography. Uh, some of it's photography. Some of it were painted things. And then... Uh, yeah, I used to, uh, I like to run the machine, you know, to do the acrylic. I can run the machines. Um, so I have done that before, but I, yeah, here's my one. This one is staying here. I love my angel. Yeah, but I do have an angel one that I painted this morning that is going to look for a forever home, okay? Um, so I'll show that to you in just a little while. Let me put this over there. This is, like I said, oil. It's going to take a while to, to cure, but I love that angel. That one is staying here with me um, for a while. <laughs> I love the presentation of it. The other one that I did this morning is three angels. So I'm going to show you that in a little while. Up for grabs, looking for a forever home.
I love to adopt out my paintings, you know, um, so that's fun. Oh, last night I did, um, I was watching the portrait thing, you know, I like the, the show, the portrait artist of the year and the um, landscape artist of the year. They get four hours to paint, okay, and uh, yeah, so I did a, uh, I did a fun crazy one the other day with fun colors and stuff, just caricature, okay, so I wanted to play with colors and stuff, so that was fun, but I did one last night, and I like this one. This is of Tom Courtney, um, I think it's from England, but there's my one that I drew of Tom Courtney. And I think that one turned out um, really well. I think it looks like Tom Courtney. So um, the uh, it's getting better. The other one, the green and purple face, that one was fun to do. Kind of, <laughs> kind of a character. So that's fun as well. Um, yeah. So those are my little artist cards there. And thank you for the uh, suggestions that people have been making about, you know, how to put up my artwork. The one was funny. <laughs> Go down to the box thing and dress in your old ragged clothes and take a few paintings. <laughs> oh my goodness. We do, there is one guy that does do, he, he's homeless and he does do art though. And he's out by the Starbucks sometimes and sells his art down there. Now I did buy a piece from him some time ago. And, uh, yeah, so, <laughs> but I thought that one was a bit humorous, you know. But I know what you mean. They were talking about these guys, you know, they're, they're out there wanting handouts, and they're smoking cigarettes, and, uh, you know, it, it <clears throat> who could afford that? What are cigarettes, five, six dollars a pack now? And uh, smoking cigarettes and drinking, you can see some of them are inebriated. None of that stuff is cheap. How, can, and you're homeless and you're spending your money on cigarettes and alcohol? <laughs> oh, really? Oh my goodness. But uh, yeah, anyway. Mm. That coffee is good this morning. I'm waiting for the sun to come up and waiting for those paintings to dry. I think I'm going to try them in. I do have a frame that fits those. The other angel painting is in there at the moment and up on the wall out there. That was the one I got. Uh, the one up on the wall is the one I got when I was in meditation and all of a sudden this, you know, impression was there um yeah it's hard to explain it when you get that impression it's not i can feel the color i can feel it it's not that i'm having an actual visual of it but yeah hard to explain but I could feel the colors in that. I could feel that, especially that deep uh, ruby red. It was kind of like, uh, you know, uh, oh, Wizard of Oz with the ruby red slippers, kind of like that. I mean, this brilliant, beautiful red, red and purple. And, and it was just, you know, you can't capture it in these paints these paints are so dull and those colors you could feel it was just vibrant you know translucent vibrant but just so 
filled with with color. It was just ah, uh, magical, you could say, <laughs> just absolutely fabulous. So, yeah. Once in a while, you know, that happens. You get an impression, or like this morning. Got up. I don't know what I'm hearing this morning. It was out there like beeping. Beep, beep. It's some kind of a beeping kind of a tone. Out there at uh, 3.30 a.m. Now, what it was, I don't know. Because I've never heard a beeping tone like that. But, uh, you know, it was enough to, to get me up and then it was just, you know, go paint the angels, go paint the angels. All right, I'm going to go paint the angels. <laughs> go, again. go paint this morning, okay? <laughs> I'm up, I'm, I'm going to go paint. <laughs> I'm going to paint now. <laughs> Which was okay. You know, it's like when those paintings come, they come and it's quick. It's like, uh, I can't sit there and second guess it. If I sat there, I don't understand how people do paintings and they're working on it for months and months, you know. Um, mine come and, and it's just like, boom, boom, it's, it's quick. I have to get the impression when, it, when it's there and get it translated out. So um, that's the way it works here. Now, um, yeah, I was just thinking to go get those paintings. They should be dry by now because acrylic dries very quickly. wanted to give it a little time but it's going to be fun to do the reveal yeah <laughs> so on that note I think I'm going to leave this here for now and uh, look online and see what's up anything new going on um, and then this morning at 10, we have the meditation time from 10 to 10.30. So um, I'll be online for the meditation <laughs> for those with the energy connection. <laughs> Most of the people that are coming to it are my students. They do not want to miss a time for darshan. You know, anytime they can come, you know, it's an aid to still the mind, and so they jump on the chance. So, uh, yeah. For me, it's just sitting because it doesn't change. If I'm meditating, not meditating, it's the same. It's a still mind. So for, for them, while there's a connection that aids them to still, for me, it's just sitting there. <laughs> It's like, oh, it doesn't make a difference. And that's why, you know, say when you get to the point, it's meditating without meditating. You're not meditating. It's when you're in a still mind, that's meditation. Okay. So one is always there. So it doesn't matter what I'm doing. It's the same consciousness the same flow okay so on that note i'm going to leave this here give those paintings just a little more time and uh looking forward to unveiling them and to see what home they'll be going to thanks for tuning in I've got to find out what it costs to send them because I'm I'm not sure for that large of a painting I've got to um, <clears throat> go down to the post office and and see if I can figure it out anyway 
on that note, I'm going to leave this here.